The Big Ten uh, group in the Labour Party embarked on an advocacy walk in the federal capital territory to encourage the collection of permanent voters' cards by citizens. Members of the group moved from the Unity Fountain to the INEC headquarters. The peaceful demonstration was led by Pat Tommy, a professor of political economy, and Tanko Yunuse, former national chairman of the National Conscience Party. So today, we want to participate in a democratic exercise. An exercise of expressing our views in freedom to the people who man the Electoral Commission. And to say to them that they have the possibility of having their names crafted in gold for all of posterity if they would only give everything they have to ensure one that all of those who have registered to vote receive their PVCs. Secondly, to understand that the process that they have embarked on is a biometric process. In fact, you should not need your PVC to vote because you have been captured. Your biometrics are in the system. If you show up on election day without any PVC, by the time your finger uh, prints are seen, your face is seen, automatically it, will, it should be able to say you are the person who registered. And so we are saying to the leaders of INEC today, and we'll present them a formal letter, it is time to make democracy work for Nigeria. We have demands and we have requests by the Nigerian youth, the aged, the Nigerian women, the Nigerian under-trodden, who are demanding that they have come out in large numbers to register for the election in 2023. And so therefore, they are requesting and demanding that their PVC will be made available to them to enable them exercise their franchise. Immediately. Anything short of that is totally unacceptable. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.